So Jack, first of all, your thoughts on the game today? Tough game. Um, we knew it was going to be that from, from minute one. Uh, they pressed time. We thought they were going to tie, but credit to them, they didn't. Um, it was a tough game. That's what Shrewsbury are about. Um, we knew that. So um, overall, it's probably a point deserved for both teams. Um, but on a selfish point of view and a defensive point of view, it's good to start the season with a clean sheet. So uh, it's something to build on, definitely. Um, and it puts us in good stead now going on in the season. You say defensively a clean sheet, but going forward, you had a couple of chances as well, didn't you? Yeah, we did. I think with, with the forward players that we've got, we'll always get chances. So, um, you know, I don't think you can look at them and say they've got to put them away. Their keeper pulled off a couple of good saves. Um, we've hit the bar uh, twice, I think. So, yeah, their chances were there um, and, and they had chances as well. Um, I think all chances were from set pieces, so it sort of showed what sort of a game it was. And, you know, it was... Like I said, a well-deserved uh, point for both teams. On a personal note, congratulations on 100 appearances. Did you think that that day would come? <clears throat> um, yeah, probably about four years earlier than it has. Uh, no, injuries held me back, I know that. Um, but it's good to to finally tick off 100 games for, for this club. And, you know, long may it continue and hopefully there's another 100 in the bag. So, um, yeah, it's, a, it's something that I wanted to, to happen a lot earlier. Um, but like I said, injuries have sort of held that back. So... You know, hopefully they're behind me now. I've had my fair share, um, and hopefully we can get another hundred quicker. You must get tired of having to answer the question, but injury-wise, how are you feeling? Yeah, I feel good. Um, I think a bit of common knowledge now that it was me that didn't come back um, from lockdown, and in in all fairness, it probably stead me well. Um, I could concentrate a lot on my fitness and, and and strengthening my legs, which is something I did for four months solid, which during the season I, I wouldn't have got that opportunity. So from a selfish point of view, it, it done me well. Um, of course, I wanted to be here with the team, but I had to do what was right for my family. Um, and it stood out well for me. So, um, yeah, I'm feeling good injury-wise. And, you know, I've just got to stay on top of it now and got a good programme going with the, the fitness coaches and the physios. Um, and as long as I can stay out of that treatment room, I'll be I'll be happy. Yeah, and looking ahead to the coming season, you've obviously played two games alongside Sean Raggett and kept two clean sheets. Is that a partnership that you can see working? Yeah, definitely. I think um, you obviously look at Downs out of the team as well, who's a great defender who's played at a high level. Um, I think whoever plays is, is going to have a good partnership. Um, we work hard defensively in training and... You know, we sort of know each other's roles and, you know, you talk on the pitch. I think that's the third time I've played with Rags, maybe fourth for the checker trade. So, yeah, I think it's just I'm looking for something similar to what I had with Clarkey and, you know, Rags is looking for something similar he had with Burge and hopefully we can both fill those fill those gaps that have missing from other players. Um, but so far it's worked out well for us both and, you know, we're hoping to carry on on that, um, that run together. Yeah, just finally Brighton, the, the next game, is that one that you really relish, obviously Premier League opposition? Yeah, for every single time you pay, uh, play um, a higher level team, you want to impress and you want to do well. And, you know, for us, it's just focusing in on the competition and trying to get them through to the next round. That's the, the main thing for us. I don't think we can let uh, the opposition get ahead of us and look, look at them being the bigger team. Um, it's a one-off game and you've seen a lot of cup upsets and we'll be looking to go and make one.